camera on, so today I'm going to be opening up a lot of Remint figures. <laughs> uh, mainly these. Um, but yeah, I'll open these three last. This is a special like goodie bag that YY Kawaii did. Um, there was like X amount of Pokemon items for I think it was £12 and it's definitely worth a lot more than that. Um, it was that good, I actually opened it up and looked at it and was like, I've got somebody else's order because there's no way that this is my my Pokemon order because, well, it's too good. <laughs> but yeah, we got one of these, Remint um, Terranium Collection number seven. Some pretty cool ones in here. There's Mew, which is a good one. Um, Farfetch would be a good one, but then there is Pikachu and Growlithe as well. But the other things that I got is this <laughs> little Jigglypuff, adorable. It's gonna go on my little Pokemon shelf. Um, I got another one of these, which are the figures that you kind of build up yourself, like the innards are inside the head. Um, I do already have this, but still a nice thing to get um, and then I got these which I am in love with these are like little um, kitchen bags like you put like fruit or something in them but they'll look like sweets they look like see they look like a candy shop kind of thing I already bought like some of these they weren't this style but I love this but then I got my first ever packet of um, Japanese Pokemon trading cards. I've never had any of these before so I am excited but nervous. So. so they have the different back on them. I didn't get anything amazing but still pretty cool to get my first Japanese pack of cards. So show them to you camera wants to focus which it doesn't you get less cards in these I think in the UK ones you get is it 10 8 or 10 in these you get five um, but yeah my first ever Pokemon pack so then moving on to this one which is the one that I got with the um, the goodie bag Oh my god, <laughs> I got far fetched. Yes. So these are awesome. I love these. I have five of them over there on my shelf. So I'm a big fan of these terrariums. Um, this one. And then I've got like another four here. So I'm a big fan. So after quite a lot of faffing around, he is in there. Let me turn this light off so maybe you can see it a little bit better. So there he is. All these things are like individual pieces that you have to put together. Um, I've realised now that I've put it in the upside down because this is the top, uh, this is the bottom and <laughs> yeah, I put it in the wrong way but you get the idea. These are awesome. <laughs> okay on to this one which is the Utatane basket. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Um, but I think I got Vulpix in this one. These are the ones that I know which I've got. So yeah, I got Vulpix. These ones aren't the terrarium things. These are like baskets that you put them in. Okay, so here's this one. It's beautiful. I love it. Look at Alolan and Vulpix in there. There's like a little flower and everything. The very cutest. Then next we have one of the Four Season Terranium things. Um, I got two of these, I think. I got the Vulpix one and I got the Sylveon one. Don't know which one this one is. Okay, so this one could be the cutest Terranium ever. So you've got little Vulpix chilling next to a log. It's so cute! Look at it! <laughs> Absolutely adorable. And lastly, but by no means least, we have the Sylveon one, which has got tape on it. Oh. 
so much mess on my bed right now. Does this one have? Oh, just two. Okay, so this one is really cute, but it's very, very weird. So it's a lot smaller than the other ones. Like the figure itself is a lot smaller. I guess that's to accommodate all of the ribbons. But it's like it's the actual base itself is smaller as well. The terrarium itself has this design on it, like flowers and hearts and stuff. I love it okay so that is everything for today thank you so much for watching please subscribe all that good stuff and i will see you all again very very soon adios